Hey, what's up, guys? It's Mike, and we're going to try to do kind of just a quick shooting video of the Tippmann C3 propane marker. I don't know why a lot of people are obsessed with this gun. They don't really make it anymore, and, and I've never actually even seen one on the field, but everybody was like, what about the propane marker? What about the propane marker? Well, let's see what we got here. So, I think for the propane marker, the C3, we'll probably use the Prophecy LTD. And let me um, let me dial this thing down a little bit. I'm telling you, Joseph, kids really piss off, dude. <laughs> kids really pissed off. Let's see here. We gotta dial down the speed. Dial down the torque. All right, we're straight. And then, yeah, we'll use the sound. There we go. All right, cool. So, I guess, if I read the instructions right, we just got back from Walmart and we bought a propane tank. Let me take the cap off of it. Because you can't screw a big propane tank in it, like a fucking blue rhino. You can't put a blue rhino on this thing and then go swap it out at Home Depot afterwards. So, anyway, let's go ahead and screw this in. How far do you guys screw this thing in? I guess that's it. So, let's see here. Holy shit, dude, do you hear how loud that was? <laughs> Did you hear how loud that was? Yeah, that was really loud. Okay. All right, now we got that off. And let's go ahead and put the loader on. You, you really smell that. It's you smell it? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so let's get some... Let's put some paint in here. And let's... What's crazy was the, uh, they say that you're supposed to prime it, like pump it three or four times. I'm actually kind of nervous to pump it more than once, you know, to shoot more than once. That seemed warmed up to me. Uh, how are we going to get my hand in here? But anyway, let's give us a shot. Oops. Seems to be shooting okay. Let me try a chrono again. It feels like it's like 240. I'm shooting about 300. Do you smell that? Smells like, <laughs> actually... Sounds like barbecue. What's weird is like, like you give it a second to, it is warm. Like you can feel like it's warm to the touch. Like it's actually got to warm up. Like you can feel it. Like you can actually feel it. Oh shit. <laughs> actually, it's, it's, other than it getting you know a little bit warm, it's just fine. Mm. You want to use this tomorrow to play x -ball? Fight. Alright, cool. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna guess, dude. That dude smells like, smells like a barbecue. Like, like, seriously, it smells like that, that propane smell. So. I don't do the prophecy, I'll do Get it out, we'll throw some churrasco on top of it. <laughs> <laughs> Trigger? You want to try it? Yeah, here. Let me get the thing for you. Alright, I'll grab the camera from you. Oh, shit. God. 
told you. I'm going to have to cock it again. Now cock it again. Now shoot it again. There it goes. It just shot two more. Yeah. It's pretty accurate. Like once it gets warmed up, it shoots the paint just fine. But like that first one or two shots... No, I don't think it doesn't feel like it's gonna get that hot. I mean, yeah. Touch it on. Look at it. That's getting warm. That's what I'm talking about. No, don't shoot my fence. Oh my god, that was close. Yeah, it was like three of them. <laughs> See what it does? It walks up like the first shot's like 150, then it goes like 250, then 300. You know? You have a temperature reading? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, actually, I've got actually a temperature sensor. I can. I'll put it on there when we do the official review. See how hot we can get it. All right. That's cool. So, all right, cool. So that's it. So that's the uh, the C3. Joseph will be using it tomorrow. <laughs>